Welcome back to Good Morning Vale. Very special guest here in the studio with me this morning. We have Dantaline from Carrots and also Koji Kawamoto, the pearl expert. This is a very, it's a very big treat. Koji only comes a few select times throughout the year. Yes. And you happen to be here yep. right before mm -hmm. Christmas Day. And of course, today kicks off Hanukkah. So perfect timing yes. to be here in the studio. Mm -hmm. yep. So I want to start off really quickly. Dan, tell us about Carrots. You've, you've been in the Vail Valley for a long time, producing incredible jewelry. Well, I've been designing jewelry in Vail since 1970, so going on 47 years. Yeah. And so not only do you design custom pieces, but then you also have artists like Koji, mm -hmm. who are very specialized in certain techniques, and yours happens to be pearls. What is it about pearls that you love so much? Oh, because uh, I'm from uh, Mie Prefecture, Japan where uh, this whole industry started. So I feel responsible to introduce beautiful pearls into the world. And I think so. you, you do just that. Now, yeah. Dan, typically throughout the year, you, you carry a certain well, amount of pearls. We always have some pearls okay. from Koji, quite a few. But when Koji comes, it's a, you can't imagine how many. Now, you brought just a, a selection with you this yeah. morning, and so there really is something, if people are interested in maybe just, just starting off with a pair of earrings, or mm -hmm. if you're interested in more of a statement piece, you have really brought quite a selection. What are we looking at right now? Well, okay, uh, first of all, uh, white, small white one uh, out of Japan, and uh, Koya, uh, Koya pearls. They are most classic, so I have lots of uh, studs earrings, so it's uh, very ideal for a Christmas gift. And then, uh, so we started sending our technicians to uh, Australia and Tahiti and the Philippines. So big black one or golden and white ones are coming out. So I have uh, such a variety and especially Tahitian pearls, right? It's not only black, right? right? Pistachio, yeah. and what green. you're wearing, fresh water. Mm -hmm. Yes. From China. And this, this piece that I have on right now, I mean, the weight of it, and it's just, it, you, can, you just feel instantly a little bit prettier, I think. Yeah, so this is Australian, white South Sea, and fresh water, pink, oh, okay. combined. Yeah. yeah, so that's beautiful. Oh, right? I, and I, I have to tell you, I feel beautiful in it. And so yeah. there, there's a variety of colors. It's not just, just black or white anymore. There's mm. really a lot of variety. Yeah, that's uh, right. And years ago, it used to be you wouldn't mix them. You'd never put South Sea with fresh water. And now, well, Koji is making mixtures on strands that nobody imagined 10 years ago. And the one that we're looking at right now, that you can see the variety in this particular strand, but this is 72 inches? Yes. Yeah, six feet. Six feet. Wow. <laughs> so <Lola. laughs> there's a lot of different options in how you can wear a strand like this, obviously. And then as we kind of cruise over a little bit towards the right, we have also a little bit more variety in the color that you can see really clearly. Yeah, clear th that is all from French Polynesia, all Tahitian. Black, green, gray, blue, all different colors mixed. It's so fascinating. And then, Koji, I know mm -hmm. too, uh, it can be kind of intimidating to pick out the perfect necklace, but yes. you happen to be an expert in really sizing mm -hmm. up and, and matching the pearls with the girl. Yes. How do you do that? Well, I have like, 25 years of experience, so I met so many people all over the world. So judging from uh, your atmosphere and uh, your color of eye and hair and skin tone, something always clicks in my head. Well, I can tell you from firsthand mm -hmm. experience, it's amazing to see how you do that mm -hmm. so perfectly. And so if people want to come in and see you, Koji Dan, tell us where mm -hmm. Carrots is located. Uh, we're two doors east of Latour, that really good restaurant. And, um, or another way to say it, we're across the street from Solaris on the east end of the Village Center building. And how long will you be open tonight if people need to get those last We'll minutes? be there till people quit coming in. We have a party to go to, but yes. we'll put that off until everybody's come in. Okay. Yeah. And uh, one more thing. I have something special this time that's called keshi. It's a gift from the oyster. Yeah, they're accidental. They're, they're yes. A pearl farmer is plant, implanting to make a cultured pearl, and when they open mm -hmm. up the oyster, there are two pearls. The, the second pearl is called a cashew pearl. It's a gift from the oyster. 
That's so perfect. So, that's so no nucleus in it. There's, so there's so yeah, many incredible right. varieties, and you can see that cashew right there mm -hmm. on the right-hand side. We'll leave mm -hmm. you with a look at some of those gorgeous pearls as we toss things over to Mark to take a look at that local weather forecast.